All right, so for the small block, I'm gonna be switching from the factory electric fuel pump to using a mechanical fuel pump. And on the mechanical fuel pump, the tube actually comes in from the front of the engine. So what I did with this, I, here's the, the factory uh, fuel line. This is a return line. This is a supply line. I was able to use the factory tubing. This was originally standing straight up. The fuel filter was originally standing straight up. So I just turned it down to go up through the filter and then come back down. The exhaust headers are going to be here. So I wanted to go around the exhaust. I actually converted this. This is a old power steering line. So I cut it how I wanted it. It's mounted to the frame, so I like that. It's nice and secure coming out of the filter. So I convert, converted the power steering line to a fuel line to come around the front to where the fuel pump is going to be, and then it'll I'll be able to put a line in right to the fuel pump there. So that should work pretty nice. I'm not going to be using the return line. So I'll show you what I did on the tank. There's the tank. I did pull all of this out. This is the line that has the fuel pump connected to it. So I'm actually going to be using this as my supply line. This used to be the return line, but it does go all the way to the bottom of the tank. Uh, so with my filter that I have, I'm not really too worried about it. There's a filter in the line that you saw, and there's one in the carburetor also. So then I just took a bolt and then welded it, put it in here, and then welded this shut. Uh, so I shouldn't have to worry about that. I'll paint that and then slap this thing back in there and should be good to go.